Hey, so uh, remember that remember that video I told you about last week? The video, yeah. It's it's ready. I feel like this is a good place to start today's video. Good morning, guys. Welcome back to the video. Woo. Where am I? Oh. Ah. Now is the right time to start today's video. Let me pass you on the right here. Pass you. What's up, brother? Gotta keep up, Avalon. So let me start today's video. Good morning, everyone. Welcome back. Today I'm in Venice Beach. I have not been here in like two years. Um, if you remember, me and Jake used to come down here and film videos all the time. And it's kind of where a lot of my YouTube videos started. We would just come down here with no plan. Oh my goodness, people. Today, I'm in Venice Beach with the woman herself. This is my friend Avalon back here. This is her first time in America, so I'm just showing her around. We came to see Venice in Santa Monica because she's never seen it before, and we're going people watching, which is also very fun because if you guys have ever been to Venice Beach, it's like a human circus. There's just all sorts of type of people here. It's very entertaining. The water's blue, there's people on skateboards, and we're gonna see some of that. So Avalon, your first time in America, what do you think about the, the bike rides? Well, last day, last day in America, but first time here. How are you enjoying it? I think I'll move here. You think you'll move here? Yeah. Okay. okay. I got a lot of space. It's also really funny because I'm already from America, so I don't get to appreciate all the weirdness here because I'm kind of used to it, but being with um, an Australian, you see a lot of it. Alright, we're gonna have a vlog drag race. You ready? Three, two, one, go. <laughs> one handed, let's go! Come on! No, oh, he's pulling! He's pulling! Let's go! Look, Avalon, real life buff guys. In America. Look, a real life seagull. They probably have those in Australia. Excuse me, miss, your keys are in your door. <laughs> Excuse me, sir, your keys are in your door. You got a tail whip? Bar spin? None of that. Aww. Posers! Jesus. These millennials and their electric scooters. Absolutely disgusting. Excuse me, miss. Your keys are in your uh, bike. Oh, I ruined that one. The best part about America is that you can kind of say whatever you want to anybody as long as it's not offensive. But the problem is, is that in this day and age, there's a lot of things that are offensive. So you have to be very careful. Try it. Just give it a shot. Say something to this guy. Sure. Say, hey, you're pretty cute and American. Right here. Oh, Venice Beach public prank. What do you, what do you think? You gonna give it to her? Okay. <laughs> okay. Yeah, public pranks. Hey, it's just a prank, bro. It's just a prank. So, Avalon, how does it feel to be rejected by your first American? Yeah, it's, it's tough. It is a hard knock life out here, isn't it? Also in Venice Beach, you will get live witnesses of people doing drugs on the beach. That's right. That's what that. That's what that was. Excuse me, sir. Could you take a picture of us? Oh, on your camera. Yeah. Ready? Ready? Yeah. Ready. Thank you, bro. Thank you. Just. Uh, I'll get your email. We can link on MySpace. Everyone's so friendly here, huh? Who do you think has nicer people, Australia or America? You say Australia? You gotta wait back. We're trying to prove a point. Australians are not as nice as Americans. Australians or Americans? Choose one. Australians. What? One point Avalon, zero points Tanner. All you non-goers to California, this is Venice Beach. Yes, it is the real life GTA 5. There's art on the floors. We got tents. We got people on birds. What else? Electric bikes. Are those fun? I never... Yo! <laughs> How you doing, bro? Hey, good. See? People are so nice. Your first witness of a real-life Instagram model. Live in the show. Yes, work it. Yo! Vlog gang. Let's go. Let's go. YouTube content. Same. Bike ride. It's complete. It's 4.37 in the morning, and I'm at LAX right now. Kind of a weird video, I know. We started in LA, went to Venice, um, did a little bit of tourist stuff. I just dropped my friend off at the airport. She's headed back to Australia, so now it's 4.30 in the morning and I'm in LA. Right now, um, I'm very tired, and thankfully, Autopilot is going to carry us um, all the way to the Victor Royale back home. Update, it's 4.47 in the morning. I'm sure a lot of you guys know this. A Tesla is fully electric. If you didn't know that, you live under a rock. I have to go stop at a charging station right now before I drive home at five in the morning. And I thought it would be kind of cool to show you guys how it actually works. And by the way, what better time to be next to SpaceX than right now? Look, we've got the SpaceX rocket right there. Homie crossing the street. 
vlogging and driving. All right, I gotta find the charger station. So if you go to enter a trip in a Tesla, um, like say I wanna go home right now, it'll actually pull up a charging station that is the closest to you because the car knows that you don't have enough charge to get there, which is what I'm trying to find right now. Oh, where is this? Well, I'm going into, I'm going into Tesla and SpaceX right now, so this is just where my car took me. Let's go this way. Let me ask Tesla, homie. Excuse me? Uh, where can I find the charger for this? Thank you so much. No SpaceX traffic, yeah, buddy. Only T Fox traffic. 4 a.m. adventures, let's get it. Yo, we're behind the scenes right now at SpaceX. I'm getting you guys this top of the line, never before seen footage. I was actually just here for the Tesla event. I don't know if you guys saw that video. What are the odds I end up here again? This is literally where the Tesla event was held. Oh, here we go, I found them. Thank you. God, all the Tesla people are so nice. This is literally it. This is a Tesla gas station. Sorry, supercharging station. So this is how it works. You pull up at one of these places. Um, if you have a Tesla, I'm pretty sure you automatically, your car is kind of connected to this thing and it will almost like detect when you're showing up. Press that. Need to charge it and uh, boom. Wait for it to turn the good color. The good color. The good color. Supercharging. Yo, here we go, here we go. Just like that, you show up, it detects your car, so you have like an account with Tesla, and then you can plug your car in and fuel up, or charge up. Also, one more fun fact. When you use a Tesla supercharging station like this right here, it takes 30 minutes for your car to get completely charged. It's not that long of a time to charge a car. Basically, it was telling me if I don't come and do this, I had to stay under 60 miles an hour in order to make it home. Look, okay, the past week, I've been just enjoying life. I've been hanging out with my friend Avalon. I've been showing her around the United States. Uh, <laughs> California, same thing. I've been showing you around the United States. I showed her the whole thing. Anyways, you get the point. I've been super, super, super busy. I feel like I've put a little less effort into my YouTube videos the past couple of uploads, which is which is not so much like me, but I wanna shoot straight with you guys. I have so many fun videos planned and so many crazy things. I'm actually gonna give you a little bit of a sneak peek when we get home. But Fox fam, I love you guys so much. I didn't even get a thank you for hitting 8.7 million. We hit 8.7 million. 8.7 million people on this YouTube channel. I haven't talked about that yet because it was only a couple days ago, but so many big fun videos planned and guys, you already know that the videos get like 30 times better, the spirits are higher, the vibes are high, the friends are around, there's so much to do. It's nice out, summer's gonna be amazing, but uh, lots of big videos coming soon. I will not let you guys down, I never do. We're roughly uh, 10 minutes into charging here. You can actually see how fast this thing will go up in percentage. Wait till it goes, we'll wait till it goes from one, seven. Oh, here we go, all right, watch how fast until it gets to 180. Alrighty guys, we are live from the cockpit of the Model X. We are in full autopilot mode right now. I have not filmed a video and like talked about this. I, I can just look at you guys and not even have to worry about, I, I should worry about that and I'm going to, I'm gonna look for it. But <laughs> the point, I haven't filmed the autopilot in this car. Um, I don't know if you guys have seen videos about it. I never watched videos about it before getting this car. To do it in person, you can see, apply light force to the steering wheel. Yes, Tesla, of course, anything for you. It's so easy to use, it's insane. It's it's the most surreal feeling, like letting a car drive you on the freeway. Like, it's it's so weird. This feels like this big moment of truth when you pull these little tiny, it's too dark to see, but the car just takes over and literally starts driving itself. Check this out, I can also lane change. Well, we're gonna wait for this car to pass. Like a safe boy. By the way, update, it's, it's 5.40 in the morning. Here we go. Oh, so there's a car there actually, and I just took the blinker on. So it'll show you that the car's there. Car will pass. And then Model X will, oh, not change lanes because there's a car in the way. But it literally detects cars. Changes lanes, lane has been changed, just like that. Like, I don't understand how that's possible. Hats off to you, Elon. Editor's note, I don't want to give complete credit to Elon. I feel like everyone does that. Good job, Tesla team. There it is, let's go. So in the car this morning, by the way, it's 11 a.m. now. I came home, I had to fall asleep for a couple hours. I was completely dead. I told you guys, I had a little bit of surprise for you guys working on a giant. Jo Johnny, it's a big video, right? Uh-huh. Like, 
took us a week. I mean, you want a little hint of what it is? Maybe a little hint, but I, but the the biggest thing is is that they don't know what we're doing with it. Oh. Yep. Well, there's your hint. Anyways guys, to end off today's video, we're working on a bunch of really big videos coming soon for this week, so get hyped. Make sure post notifications are on. Make sure your hair is in front of your face like mine is. Before we end off today's video, I have to announce the last winners of the SSG giveaway. Before I do this, I want to say I am like blown away by support um, on this giveaway. It's, it's crushing way harder than the last one did and I'm so thankful, I'm so happy. I'm so stoked that tons of people are joining the movement and becoming a part of Space Station Gaming and supporting Space Station Gaming. So without further ado, I gotta pick the last three winners and then we are gonna get everyone's prizes all shipped out in the next video. So we have the Xbox, we have the iPhone, and we have the PS4. Before I pick the winners, I wanna say, Thank you to anyone that has entered. I wanted to do this to thank you guys for joining and supporting Space Station Gaming. There'll be plenty more of these in the future, so stick around. Make sure you're following Space Station Gaming. Make sure you're liking all the posts. You never know when I could just send you an Xbox or something really cool. We're gonna end off today's video. I got the, my really big video surprise here in the background. I guarantee nobody can guess what I'm doing with this. You're probably like, dude, it's obvious. We saw what it was, but you're not gonna guess it. Speaking of which, Solo Flow is calling me. Guys, world's best flipper. Yo, Sol. Good, huh? Yo, bro. Hey, so uh, remember that remember that video I told you about last week? The video, yeah. It's it's ready. Without further ado, I'm just gonna go ahead and pick the winners. All right, I got three random names right here. Congratulations at S I E N N A W A R D fourteen twenty six on Twitter. You are the proud winner of a brand new Xbox. What is that? One Xbox One with Xbox a gold one. with an Xbox Gold <laughs> membership that comes with it. So congratulations, you're officially an SSG gamer. For our second winner, the PS4. Congratulations at Edward C Stowe Jr. on Twitter. Congratulations, you are the proud winner of a brand new PS4. And for our final winner, iPhone 8. Ooh, Guys, this is what everybody wants. I want to give this iPhone. This is the biggest prize of the whole thing. I want to give this to one of the biggest SSG supporters that I've seen over the past couple of months. Like I said, I did a giveaway like this a couple months ago to kind of bring you guys on board with SSG, and there's been so many people that have stuck around, and this is one of them, so congratulations at Spider Tanner on Instagram. You are the winner of the iPhone 8. Thank you guys for supporting SSG. You continue to support SSG. I want to continue to support you. So if you guys have anything you want from Best Buy, make sure if you ever think about it, just tweet me a picture of it, and uh, make sure you follow on SSG, because you never know. Without further ado, peace out. Let's the Fox. Enjoy that video because it was so cool. So don't forget to subscribe and leave a like and buy the hottest merch in the game at tfoxbrand.com. The link will be in the description. So peace out and roll the outro.